Today on AI Adventures, we're diving headfirst into a revolutionary tool that will unleash your creativity and transform the way that you communicate visually. Get ready, because we're about to unveil the power of text to video with Gen 2, which was just made available to the public yesterday. If you're not super tech savvy like myself, the good thing it requires no fancy equipment, no technical expertise, just your creativity and a keyboard, and then you can create videos like this using just the power of your imagination. But before we embark on this AI adventure, if this is your first time here, I'm Paul, and I cover all the latest in the world of AI on this channel. But don't forget to hit that subscribe button, join our community of AI enthusiasts, because the future is here, and together we'll uncover all of its possibilities. So picture this, you're a busy entrepreneur with a game-changing product, but need to captivate your potential customers instantly. Or maybe you're an educator that wants to create visually engaging lessons that have a lasting impact. And that is where this text to video software like Gen2 comes in, unleashing a new era of communication. So this Gen2 AI software was developed by Runway Research, who's been around for a while doing a lot of developments in the world of AI. And you can go to their site, sign up for free. It's research.runwayml.com backslash Gen2. I'm gonna put a link down in the description as well. And you can go to this page, you can sign up for their site, and it allows you to do a lot of AI creation with their stuff. But today, what we're gonna focus on in this video is their text to video stuff. We're gonna focus on mainly two modes that you could do with Runway. Mode one is text to videos. We're gonna get some prompts and create some videos and chop them all together for you guys. Other thing we're gonna do is use text plus one of our own images that we've generated from Mid Journey and use that to generate a video. So let's get right into it. And the Gen 2 landing page looks like this. It's very simple, but it has everything you need here. This is the place that you're gonna enter your prompt. And what the Runway dev said, as far as the way that you're gonna enter, the style you're gonna enter your prompt, first you're gonna use your base prompt, which is the subject. So what you want your subject to do, what you want going on in that video. And then you're gonna enter the style that you want that video. So for example, in the style of professional cinema or photography, or in the style of a documentary or a feature film or a cartoon, and you could have a larger depth of field, a shallow depth of field. You could specify uh, how far you want that camera, what type of shot you want. So a lot of different things you could do here. We're going to enter some prompts in just a little bit, but let's continue to navigate around. We have settings here, and the first thing we see here is the seed. So you can either lock this if you want to use the same seed for all your projects or unlock this. Now, in the world of AI, basically what the seed is, is the place that the AI is gonna start its generation. So if you want similar generations at the end product, what you want is the AI starting in the same place so that these end generations look similar. They're not gonna be exactly the same, but if you have the AI starting in the same place, the end result will look pretty similar. So what we wanna do is lock this for all of our videos here. Interpolate will smooth out your frame. So we do wanna check this. We don't want choppy pixelated frames here. And we do have the free version right now, but if you have the paid version and upgrade based on however much you're gonna be using this software, you have the option to upscale your, uh, your videos as well. It automatically enhance image resolution and it could also remove the watermarks on this. So those are what you could do with a paid version and you also have more time that you could use. Currently right now, we have 105 seconds that we could generate videos with and what this is, is if we look at the section for here, each second of video uses about five credits. We currently have 525 credits left and we haven't used any of these credits. So that is the default section that you're gonna use for your, that, that is the default that you're gonna get as a free account as far as that. And once those are done, they're done. So if you wanna continue using the Gen 2 software after you run out of your free credits, you would have to use the paid version. But let's enter a simple prompt here. This is just a very simple. We're gonna to try to cut together a documentary here that uh, ChatGPT created a simple documentary for us. So the first shot is a happy family gathers in the living room in the style of professional cinema. So let's go ahead and generate this and see what Gen2 comes up with. Uh, what the heck? All right, so full disclosure guys, I've been trying for a while to make a video and even though using real simple words like happy family in the living room, we keep getting flagged for term violations. So we're trying a different prompt here, guys. Happy group in living room, professional sim cinema. Trying to eliminate as many words as possible, so hopefully we don't get flagged for violations here. Let's enter this prompt, and hopefully Gen 2 won't flag us for a violation this time. Right, and there it is generated our video for us, and these faces look a little weird. Let's go ahead and play this video. And it actually looks like kind of a still image with maybe a parallax effect going on in this middle section here. So let's go ahead and download a new, let's go ahead and create a new video so we can kind of 
make these uh all join in together so what we want to do let's make sure that the seed is locked the seed is locked let's just keep it real simple so that we don't get flagged for any violations happy groups join hands let's see what kind of video it creates there all right and here are the hands let's play this video and it looks like them joining hands oh the fingers are a little weirder but again this is in the early stages just developed we got some weird angles of these fingers yeah but all right I'm, I'm pretty happy with this let's go ahead and go with our next uh video here we'll go happy group joining hands let's go happy group joyously cooking together and let's see oh, joyfully cooking together professional cinema same seed let's have it generate this video and see what it generates for us all right and a happy group joyously cooking together oh he's missing an arm uh her arm looks a little weird um all right this is not perfect her arms are backwards but all right look pretty decent results i guess people they don't do as good there's some things i guess they do better than others there's certain things arms hands that the ai is still trying to figure out let's go ahead and create that last picture this one's gonna be a warm sunset same seed professional cinema let's go ahead and generate this last video so we can cut them all together all right so here is the sunset let's go ahead and play this video and the sun isn't moving too much we do see some cloud cover moving so let's go ahead and chop this video together and see if we can get a concise story for you it's time to make every happy warm moment count enjoy the good times with your family and friends let's join hands and team up because together we're unstoppable enjoy your journey embrace life to the fullest so that was pretty cool and it took very little time very little effort obviously there are some imperfections that we could have kept re-rolling some of these clips till we got a clip that really matched our vision or don't have these imperfections but we're trying to save our credits here so now we're going to do something a little different this is an image that i created yesterday in mid journey for a thumbnail and what we're going to do we're going to use this image to create a video so we're going to go drag and drop the file here so we're going to get our image file and drag it into this here and it's going to upload that very quickly there it is and now we have our image in that section we're going to write our prompt walking down there's oh i should spell that right and we don't need to use the same seed let's go and change this settings for the seed let's uh yes let's change that to not lock it down and walking downstairs let's go sunset and let's call this a feature film all right let's generate this see what it creates for us see how it uses our mid-journey image all right and let's see if we have our model in the picture she is standing there her hair is moving she's not walking though let's see if we can generate this one more time we'll, we'll spend the credits we'll generate this one more time see if we can actually get the model in the picture her hair looks similar. It is a blonde girl. We do have that sunset there. Let's actually take off the sunset and see if we can generate a different image here or a different video here. Let's go ahead and do this one more time. All right, and here we see another girl. We see a backward shot. This time we see a camera zoom. Similar type of hair. I think the hair matches a little bit more. The shirt uh, looks very similar. The, the similar pattern there. We don't have that sunset walking up the stairs. We didn't get the model that we wanted in the picture, so it doesn't look like that base model at all, but maybe we could have used different prompts to generate some different videos that are a little more what we wanted with our vision. So that is Gen 2. Looks very, very good. Looks very promising. There's some wonkiness going on with that right now with some certain scenes, but I think that's just going to get better and better and better. Let me know what is your favorite use case for Gen 2. What kind of crazy ideas started popping into your head as you're watching these videos? What kind of stories will you now be able to create? Hopefully you got a lot of value out of this video. And if you did, don't forget to like this video and share it with your fellow AI enthusiasts who crave the cutting edge. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you never miss out on one of our latest videos. As remember at AI Adventures, we don't just embrace the future, we create it. Have a great rest of your day, Valley Maniacs. Hulk Vest Bomb Valley flying out. I'll see you next time.